Do you ever get scared? Are you kidding? I would love to be scared. I want to be scared, man. I want to be so terrified. I'm letting out little involuntary shits, okay? A lot of people love to get scared. Someone somewhere right now is lining up to get scared. Me! I'm next in line. I am the next in line. Whether it's a thrill ride, a haunted house, or a scary movie, people can't seem to get enough of this scary sensation. Curious sensation, actually. I can't get enough! And I just can't get enough. I just can't get enough. People have been scaring each other since the beginning of time. People write stories and jump out of corners to try to startle someone. This leaves some people scratching their heads wondering why that is. They're crazy. They're crazy! They really do be crazy. <laughs> to understand why people like to get scared, first we need to understand what fear is. I, I don't know and I don't want to know. Fear is an emotion induced by a person's perception of danger to them. <laughs> I'm in danger! This evokes a behavioral response of fight. You want to fight? Flight. I'm out of here! Or freeze. Freeze! We experience an adrenaline rush that gets us ready for danger and ready for action as the body releases oxytocin and those feel-good hormones, dopamine, serotonin, and endorphins. How do they work? Dopamine is a hormone that creates a high state of arousal, like joy or happiness. Serotonin does a lot, including helping you learn and remember. I can't remember. Endorphins is a natural pain reliever and helps boost your mood. I needed that boost, man! Oxytocin helps protect us from experiencing pain. No! Yeah, I didn't feel that. Being scared essentially puts us in a high arousal state. When we're in real danger, we're focusing on survival, not having fun. Oh, sweet Jesus, please let me live! But when our high arousal response is triggered in a safe place, like at home watching a scary movie, we're able to switch over and enjoy the natural high of being scared. Yeah, <laughs> man. <laughs> so why do people like to get scared? Uh, didn't we already cover this? Doing things and getting through things that make us scared can give us a real sense of accomplishment and satisfaction. I did it, man! I did it! Watching scary movies is also pure escapism. Our real life can take a back seat while we enjoy the present moment. Look at, I actually need some me time. There's also a sense of appeal when we can live vicariously through these scary experiences. Something we don't encounter all that often in our everyday lives. That, you don't see. If you're a horror movie fan, you might actually be a sedentary adrenaline junkie. The more fear, worry, and anxiety you feel, you like. I really like it sometimes. Thinking of taking a girl out on a first date? Would you want to go out with me? Ever? Take her to a scary movie. When she gets frightened, she'll curl up for protection. That might work. Going through a scary experience with someone can be a bonding moment. It can also increase the attraction between two people. That's why scary movies are ideal for date night. Ooh, date night! Studies have found that people who go through haunted houses or after watching a scary movie have a significantly higher mood probably due to the adrenaline rush. I feel really good right now. Instead of focusing on the fright you felt during the film, you'll remember having a great time and you'll want to come back for more. Do you want to go again? <laughs> this will also reinforce the bond between you two. Remember what I said about the adrenaline rush? You'll both associate those good feelings with spending time together. It's just crazy enough to work. Some people are more into scary movies than others. And that has to do with your body's chemical makeup. Those types of thrill-seeking people have a sensation-seeking personality. It takes a lot to scare me. I love the sensation. <laughs> they tend to be less stressed and perform better in high-risk sports and high-stress professions, like emergency room doctors or nurses, or special forces. Hoorah. Your biological sex may also play a role. A 2020 survey suggests that men tend to enjoy scary movies and watch them more often than women. That sounds about right. Scary movies allow us to experience fear in a safe and enjoyable way. They also help boost your immune system and might even be therapeutic. How so? There's a growing body of research that suggests that scary movies can be used in clinical settings to help people with anxiety or trauma. People can learn to control their response to fear in a safe place. This is a safe place. Scary movies can also help prepare you for the worst. 
They can give you a glimpse at life-threatening situations, which makes you feel more prepared. I'm not ready for this. So if a zombie apocalypse actually does happen, I think I know what I would do. What do I do? I don't know what to do! Ever wonder why we crave popcorn at the movies? Yeah, why is that? It's because we tend to eat a little more when we're scared. The body releases a hormone called cortisol that increases blood sugar and blood pressure. I'm gonna go get some popcorn. In the end, if watching scary movies and getting scared is good for your body and can help prepare you to possibly save your life one day, I'd say it's worth the fright.